What's up collectors, SS Joe Ducati Boy here, bringing you a review of this masterpiece by Enerbay. One quarter scale, Terminator 2 Judgment Day, battle damage, just incredible guys, incredible. Alright guys, styrofoam box, it comes in just a black styrofoam box, nothing special. I want to concentrate on the figure. So, accessories. Ammo belt. The ammo, the paint apps are so nice. I thought they were die cast. It's not, but it's just it's awesome. Look at this beautifully made duffel bag. Little working zippers on there. You can fit your whole hand in there. This is the ammo for the ammo belt and for one of the guns. I think these are smoke grenades, I'm not sure. They're die casts, real heavy. You get 10 of those. You get these little ammo, some of them are spent. One of them has a tip on it. There's the ammo belt. Like I said, it comes with 10 of the grenade things, but it's actually got 12 hoop loops to hold them. This beautiful piece right here, which I'll take off and give you a better look in a bit. And I put the mini gun just to see what you guys could do if you have the original. It's awesome. You could use one of those hands if you want the glove look. It comes with eight hands total. One of them comes packaged like that. And let me show you the detail. Look at that. That's just beautiful. Beautiful. Weathering is incredible on this figure. You also get the extra arm if you want to use this one. See nice veins on them and little freckles. And you get an extra shirt that's not tethered. All right, guys, let me show you some amazing detailing that they did with this guy. The ammo belt, got the little hoop. Even on these pieces, you can see there's like oily marks, it's just dirt. Amazing, look, they even tore it up a little. It's just amazing, the detail that they put on this, it's heavy. Guys, let's take off this gun. This figure, it stands so well. Look, he's not even on the holster. And I could just spin him like there's no problem. So, give me a minute. Put this on a tripod and I will take off this gun so I could give you a better look. Now, look at that, look at the wood, 100% real wood, scratches, look at the detail on this folds up, and even this little piece is adjustable, look at that guys, now like with the Hot Toys, turn that, you could load it up with the ammo just beautiful all right look at that the belt beautiful weathering inside and out all these zippers are functional and they zip so easily just nuts. Look at that. All those little buttons are real. Look, he's just covered in bullet holes. It's beautiful. Beautiful weathering on the pockets. Like I said, the zippers move real easy. Little belt buckles are real, they're not plastic. 
just I want to show you the weathering on these boots look at that look at all the dirt the little tears the buckles are adjustable and the dirt I left one side unzipped look it's all real leather boots they come up pretty high and the zippers like I said look at that very functional pants look dirty all those pockets are real pockets you can put stuff in them if you choose to Enterbay, Enterbay Bill thank you for this grail piece look at that all these real little zippers look at all the bullet holes the barrage of bullet holes just look at that got tears on the shirt showing a little bit of skin tears everywhere look at that just beautiful paint apps are beautiful on this thing This is real soft rubber. Look at those markings on it. It's got tiny little freckles everywhere. The paint apps, I can't stop saying it, they're beautiful. Slight scratches in that eye. Eyebrows are amazing. Right down to the ear. Just outstanding, guys. Look at that detail. That is the actual button you push. It took a little bit the first time I did it. See, there's lit up. It only stays on for 20 seconds. I don't really need it to stay on longer than that. And it goes off by itself. The button was a little hard at first. I thought it was broken, but it wasn't. After a few times, it loosens up. Poof, there it goes. And it works beautifully. Look at that. Detail, detail. The stand, it's a little more orange, rusty compared to the original one. Other than that, the same. It's just, for a little comparison, there's two of the new DX. With the Endo, another DX, and the old school. But, yeah guys, no complaints, zero, zero complaints with this. He's just, that's 100% Arnold. Not a little, not, it's just Arnold. Still love this guy, but look at the difference. I always keep the glasses on, because look, those eyes are off, the forehead's off. Just look at that, and then, yeah. You have to be blind. All right, guys, I want to give you guys a closer look at the minigun. So give me a second just to pry the minigun off his hands. And here we go. Show you some detailing. Look at this. Beautiful. Got some metal pieces. Some aren't. The detailing is incredible. That little plaque, it almost looks like it's real metal, but it's just a decal little pins they all move the real look at that the canister looks like it's been leaking look how well this thing spins it's just it's amazing look at that just wanted to show you guys that a little button joystick 
One last thing I want to show you with this. If you choose to, you can place it real nicely into the duffel bag without any worries. I did it with the Hot Toys one, but it doesn't. It goes in, but it sticks out a lot more than that. Look. Perfect. Just like the movie. Hot Toys one has a couple extra pockets. But all in all, it's cool. That is Arnie, people. Like I said, all those pockets, they're all functional. I'll give you a close-up look in here. All the joints, they click into place. This piece here is just beautiful. Look at that detailing. It's incredible. This, a few of these pieces are die cast, these bigger pieces. But look how nicely these other ones move. It's just awesome. Buckles the clothing, hangs beautifully. Like on a real person. Function. It's beautiful, guys. Look at that weathering. This leather. Oh. I did notice a few subtle changes. You see how those are horizontal? These have a slight bit of an angle. Just from the base to the top. Doesn't need anything. He stands real nicely. Incredible. Incredible. By far a grail piece for me. Anything Predator, Terminator, Spider-Man, I'm just all over it. on the detailing look at that look at the eyes Jesus I was truly psyched like a little bit Enter Bay is just knocking it out of the park I'm gonna get my Bruce Lee next week, probably. I can't wait to get my endoskeleton quarter scale from Hot Toys and the police station. They should look amazing next to this. Just amazing. Now you pop off the head real easy. It turns real smoothly. Like I said, the joints click into place. He's just beautiful, guys. Just beautiful. Alright, guys. I hope I did him justice in this review. Because this thing is a masterpiece. Okay guys, SS Joe Ducati Boy signing off. Get him guys if you love Terminator, please. SS out.